There are a number of settings that you can set at a global level in a weighted gradebook. Um, and you should do those at a global level and not change individual grade items, um, but do it globally. Once you come into the Manage Grades area, if you click on the settings, you're going to see three tabs, Personal Display Options, or Unit Display Options, and Calculation Options. This particular tutorial will talk about calculation options. Uh, you should note that you should not change any of the default settings on this tab. These settings are optimized for a weighted gradebook. The settings will be explained below for this particular grading option. So I'm not going to change the grading system, but you have final cal grade released. The choice is final calcula calculated final grade. That's going to be the one that's going to be released. The adjusted final grade is the one that would be released uh, to the user if you choose that one. But again, don't change any of these. Uh, cal grade calculations, drop ungraded items. This will exclude ungraded items from the calculation of the grade. And then treat ungraded items as zero. We'll set zero points for all of those. And note, please do not use this method because you will never know what, the, what their true grade, the students will never know what their true grade is throughout the term. You can watch a tutorial on entering zeros after due date, a batch method to enter zeros for the students. And then finally, the last checkbox, automatically keep final grades updated. If that's checked, which it will be, and again, don't uncheck it, um, this will automatically keep this final grade updated throughout the entire term so the student can know what their grade is at any time.